All right, back at it. Yesterday or last time we played, I got destroyed and choked in the final run. So I have to beat rank one eventually. That's my goal is just to beat rank one. That's all I want. Just beat rank one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Black King was the ruler. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, let's do this. Let's actually win a game of Shotgun King. Let's murder all the pawns nice and early, because screw these pawns. Alright, first floor, always easy peasy. Blade plus three, king has two HP, queen has one HP. One additional shotgun shell, remove two pawns, add a bishop, doubles fire arc for one bullet. I'll take the extra bullet, even though the blade does come in handy quite a bit. I don't really want to give them extra health, though. They only have two pawns. We got two little babies. Oh, it's nice having three bullets. There we go. I've never had an iPhone, really. I've heard things. I've heard things. One firepower, add two pawns, add one rook. The rooks have less than two health. All right, we'll throw a rook in there. Why not? We'll throw a rook in. Now there's four pawns. We do a little bit more damage. There we go. Uh, pawn can't attack you. Flip this card if a pawn is killed. Plus one ammo max, one extra soul slot. I'll take the extra soul slot and extra ammo. That seems a lot better. Now they also have a queen in the field. I just, I'm so stupid in this game. I am so stupid. Why would I shoot the pawn that the queen's behind? Why would I do that? Ah. All right, back at it. I just love shooting the pawns. I don't know why. There's something about shooting these freaking pawns and killing them instantly. That just gets that. Mm. That was that was such a good start too. That was such a good start in terms of items. Oh great, they can have more health. Move range plus one flip card if there's no knight on the board. Remove one bishop, add one queen after ten turns. I'll take the wand. They, they, I'm just such an idiot. I'm just such an idiot. What did I even add? What did I... What did, okay, they have more health. I just get so used to murdering all the pawns all the time. And it's just... I'm so stupid. Ah! All right, let's just play it smart. Be smart, be smart, be smart. Remove two pawns, add one bishop, doubles fire arc for one bullet. Add one rook, gain two ammo each time you kill a rook. One, Once per turn, you can jump over a nearby piece for one damage without ending the turn. We'll jump over pieces, and we'll, every time we kill a rook, we get two ammo. Okay. Well, I should probably record this just in case I win. Oh, I didn't mean to shoot. Fuck me! What am I doing? I just keep thinking, oh yeah, I can kill them without worrying. When I, I, I ninety percent of my runs die to me being an idiot. Ninety percent of them die to me being stupid like that. Ninety percent of them. Yeah, record just in case I win. Proceeds to lose immediately. No, this is the one, man. This is the one. Ah, oh, God. 
Two fire range. Pawns can't attack diagonally, but they can attack the front two squares instead of one. Remove a bishop and add two knights, so we have three knights on the board. I'm going to take the fire range. That could come in handy. Pawns can attack the first two spots now. You're doing great, sweetie. Oh, sweetie died. I like this range that we have. I'm just a little scared of these pawns. Because they do so much damage. They, they do a lot of damage. All right. All right, all right, all right. What the heck is this? Fire arc plus 30% to fire power. Remove two pawns. Add one's bishop. Oh, add a bishop. I'm not scared of no bishop. I ain't afraid of no ghost. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. This is the one. Guaranteed, this is the one. I'll put a prediction up right now. This is the one. Okay, wait, wait, wait. wait. Let's do a prediction. It's two minutes, two minutes. Gamble, gamble, gamble. Will we win this run? I have the confidence. This run is already looking good. Will we win this run? Yes or no? Two minutes, two minutes. Two quickie, 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 quickie. All right, will we win? Did my camera seriously just freeze when I tab back into the game? Dude, are you kidding me? Repel all white pieces northward. Blade plus three. Let's take the blade. Let's take the blade. Let's take the blade. We have high range, high damage. The queen's in play. Let's not shoot the pawns immediately. Fuck that pawn. Are you kidding me? Blade's doing good already. The blade's already doing good, man. Oh, I guess our range isn't that good. All right. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. What do we have? Queen minus two speed, but queens can't die. Not being able to kill them is kind of annoying, but they are two turns slower. Move range plus one. Flip a card if there's no knight on the board. Add two bishops after 15 turns. I'm gonna take the move range. I gotta be able to kill those queens. We'll take the bishops. I can only have plus two move range if I don't kill the knight. That's the problem. I have to not murder the knight. Like I tend to do. I murdered the knight. one bishops bishops can move not attack orthogonally add one extra soul slot and one ammo max do we want the red book or bishops can move and attack across any obstacles fuck that i am not doing that screw that why would i want the bishops 
to be able to attack anywhere when they can oh god there's three bishops on the floor immediately okay all the bishops are dead already Oh, easy peasy, baby. Yeah, but they, the bishops can move like queens, but they can't attack like queens. That's the thing. They can only move like queens, which could give me the benefit of the doubt if they have less than three health since I have the blade. I can kill them for free. And I can also deal firepower damage to a non-king target with the Wand of Wrath. And this one replaces rooks, knights, and bishops with a pawn. Oh, God. Do I want to replace pawns? Oh, shit. Jesus. Oh, this isn't good. These are not good. Ammo regeneration and range is up by one. Do I feel like having more pawns to deal with when I kill one of them? Paw if pawns reach the end, they get promoted to a random piece. So I don't want pawns to reach the end. But I think I only have two pawns on the board. I'm gonna take the ammo regeneration and the range. Let the pawns and bishops move a touch faster, I guess. Victoria unlocked. Hey, I unlocked the new shotgun. Mother fucker. Dude, I can't do anything right now. I might be able to kill this one and not worry. Yeah, we can do that. Shit. Oh my god, they're everywhere. If I kill the knight, I can't double move, and then the queen gets a freebie on me. I can't move there. I... Th turn what are you talking about you said that that the blade doesn't end the turn i thought why did that end the turn oh my god the blade is not supposed to end the turn i thought i could kill the knight and then go up here to be sa oh you game Try again? No, we have a new shotgun we can try, though. Hey, Learn. How are you? All right. Victoria, five firepower, 45 degrees spread, four fire range. Doesn't have a lot of ammo. But 
Let's try the Victoria shotgun. You're just dandy. How are you? If you're doing dandy, I'm doing fine. So we're fine and dandy. Didn't see the list. Uh, don't worry about it. Plus two firepower. Rats. All pieces minus one speed. Blade minus one. All pieces plus one HP. Rook spawning after 20 turns. More firepower. More arc. We'll take the arc and firepower. We'll take rooks every 20 turns. You love the beanie? Thank you. It's freezing in my apartment because the heat's still not on. The goddamn super lady person, they... Ah! We didn't even see the fish up there! Ah! Oh. Okay, it was only the second floor. Uh, the super lady texted me last night and was like, Hey, can you uh, turn your radiators on let the heat flow? And I was like, yeah, no problem. And she was like, thanks. And I turned them on. There ain't no fucking heat coming out of them. We've been duped! Duped! We've been smackledorfed! Fish, I said fish up. Is Ace... Alright, we're gonna take the extra ammo, extra soul card, and if we kill the bishop, this is useless. And there's only one bishop right now to worry about, so... We've been speckledorfed! Also, did you guys know if you missed a stream, you can watch highlights on the of almost every stream on the Sleeping Bear Plays channel? Exclamation mark highlights. It's a new YouTube channel I'm trying to get off the ground. Would greatly appreciate it if you checked it out. If you really like this stream, you can literally just watch it there. They're all bro- they're gonna- in, in like a few- come a few months in time, that channel is gonna be so beautifully organized, it's gonna be amazing. Nice. You enjoy full stream YouTube videos? Well, it's not full stream YouTube videos, but it is, um... It is pretty beefy videos if you check it out right now. Um, so I, every day after, every day after stream, I go back and clip a few things to make a thumbnail. I take photos on OBS to make a thumbnail as well. And then I ex highlight and export all like three or four videos for the str from the stream into it. All right, so I can drag a piece near me. Kill him. Wait, how do I throw it? What? That is insane! What the hell was that? Okay. Minus one ammo max. Add one cannonball to the chessboard. Cannonballs can be carried and can be... What's that say? Grabbed and thrown at pieces. Rook have one HP. King swap position with Rook whenever he would take damage. There's only one Rook on the board. I'll lose an ammo. Oh, shoot. We don't have a lot of ammo. Was that minus one or two ammo? Jesus. Minus one. Minus one. 
Wait, can I pick that up whenever I want? <laughs> Alright, so I can pick enemies up once per turn. And I can pick up the cannonball now. Add two pawns, add one rook. Rooks have two less health. I mean, that sounds pretty good. Subtle poison. King has one HP. Queen's moves limit one square for 15 turns. Queen has less than one. Give me that poison. That sounds so good, poison in the people. Where's that cannonball? I gotta be careful with that queen, though. The cannonball wasn't too useless, but... Or useful that time, but... We're still going. I need more ammo. Ah, shit. More firepower. All pieces, 1 8, minus 1 speed. All pieces, 1 HP. Sure, I'll do more damage. We'll give them a little more health. Oh, shit. I didn't mean to do that. Can't even move. The pawn's stuck. <laughs> the pawn can't even move because the cannonball's blocking him. Oh, great. Another cannonball. I can't afford to lose any more ammo. Ah, uh, there's 12 floors you have to make it to. I'll take knight spawn in every 10 turns, to be honest. Ah, indeed, Paul. Indeed. One rook after 20 turns. Add one queen, one extra soul slot. I do have three soul slots, but I don't want to lose more ammo. But two cannonballs could be pretty funny. <laughs> two cannonballs? Shit, why not? I'll lose another ammo. Why not? Let's have another cannonball. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Why are they over there?
Wait, can I put this down? Okay, that it was I was a little scared for a second. I thought I was going to lose because it was like, "Hey, you can't do that." But I still did it anyways. Get out of here, pawn. Get out of here, you. Oh, the stream did die. I guess the stream just died there. Well, that's unfortunate. That's going to be annoying to try to export to YouTube. <laughs> that's going to be an annoying export. I'm going to have to freaking download two different... Oh, wait, I was recording. But I didn't record all of it. All right. Anyways, we're still going strong, by the way. We're still going strong. Um, Play a white piece of your choice. Add one pawn every five turns. Blade plus three. Add three pawns. Let's add three pawns. Is this the run? I don't have a lot of ammo, but the blade will come in handy. Okay. Add in the pawns could all honestly be kind of like security. The pawns can be kind of like your protector, you know what I mean? I didn't want to shoot the cannonball. What's up, Faze Obama? Oh, I didn't see the queen. Oh, no. Dude, why is this game so hard? What up, Bearbot? Oh, my God. This gun is rough because you get no freaking ammo. If I had ammo in one of those first fights, I would have been able to kill the queen early. <sighs> it's hard though yeah propel all white pieces northward add two knights after 15 turns flip card if my shotgun's been reloaded that's freaking useless and we got one bullet in my shotgun it's gonna get reloaded instantly so I'll take the I'll take the the northward Hi, I like to murder pawns. Oh, great. Here comes the cavalry, the knights. I uh, appreciate you all being here, by the way. I do appreciate it. One per, once per turn, execute a blade with... Execute a piece with, a bla with your blade without ending your turn. Minus one firepower, plus two blade. Flip card if there's no knight on the board. Move range, plus one. With knights constantly spawning every 15 turns, having this would actually be worth it. But the king can't be killed if a knight is alive. So that's actually super annoying. Remove one bishop, add six pawns. I guess we're going to have a pawn revolution. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, no. Here they all come. Oh, 
There's a lot of pawns. Like, I don't have a lot of ammo, so all these pawns are kind of annoying. Use pawn souls to gain two firepower on your next shot. Plus one ammo max. Reload without moving lets you squeeze one more shell in the shotgun when it's full. I'm going to take the extra ammo. I, I need it. I need some more ammo. Might be able to get an extra bullet, too. Because now the queen's here. And here comes the cavalry. Am I seriously screwed here? Yeah, I'm screwed. So, what I'm learning with this gun is you can't have too many pawns because... Oh, I could have used my wand. I'm an idiot. I could have used my wand. I gotta remember that wand. Can't have too many enemies because this will get you screwed with this, with this. If you have too many enemies. Because you only have so much ammo. Uh-oh, game over. Add one queen, one add extra soul slot. Okay, let's give a queen. Let's get a queen in here. Why not? Why not? Why not ruin the game all immediately with a queen? Stab the White King for three. Get out of here, Queen. There we go. Goddamn queen, man. Having a queen this early is kind of scary. Plus one firepower. Rooks get out of that after every 20 turns. Add one knight every 10 turns. Mm, I'll take the firepower. What up, Joel? How are you doing, Joel? It's good to see you. I was gonna kill them anyways. I, I was gonna kill that king anyways. It was it was nothing. What is this? Queen minus one speed, king minus one speed every ten turns, golden agent. Uh one fire range. Oh, give me the death defiance. I need that. I'm bad. Let me get that protection from death, because there's two queens on the board now. What does that lower? My fire range. Oh, that's kind of annoying. I would still kill those in one hit, though. Are, are you kidding me? Well, I have a death defiance, actually, so we have to use it. Sub rabid. Oh, 
stinking queen, man. Stinking queen. One ammo max. Reloading without moving lets you squeeze one more shell in the shotgun when it's full. Plus two firepower. Flip a card if your king is not on the board's edge. King can't be killed if a knight is alive. Pawns can't attack diagonally, but they... Okay, we'll take the, we'll take the extra damage in pawns for the extra ammo. It's nice that I can one-shot a queen when they're right in front of my face. I will say that is exceptionally nice, being able to just one-shot them when they come in my grill. Two firepower. One firepower on white squares. Fire arc 30% on black. One firepower adds rooks. Add one rook. So we'd add two rooks every 20 turns. I'll take the two firepower, because that one doesn't add anything. That didn't kill it? How much health do you have? What? Hey, caramba. Okay, okay, okay. You see, this is why we have death defiances. They save us. Ch charge one additional shell in your shotgun. Fire arc. Oh, God. Oh, if we kill a queen, then we can do that. Add one pawn every five turns. Oh, no, thank you. I will take the extra shotgun shell. Thank you very much. How much damage we're doing. All I need to do is kill a queen. There's two of them on the board. How hard could it be to kill a queen? Okay, very hard, apparently. I think that'll die. I gotta take the death defiance. I was stuck in a pickle. I didn't mean to shoot. Hey, milady. Good to see you. We got a lot of fire arc as well. Like, the bullets are flying everywhere right now. Pawns can't attack you. Flip this card if a pawn is killed. Add one knight. Knight can only be hit when moving. Once per turn, you can jump over or near... Okay, jumping over is good. Add two pawns. Add one rook. Rook has less than two health. We already have a decent amount of pawns. They can't attack me, but if I kill one, they can attack me. I'm going to take the once per turn jumping over something and we're going to add a couple more pawns. What else? What does that do? What does that do? Rooks have less health than they... Okay, 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 okay. The arc we have on these bullets are absolutely nuts. We kill a queen in one shot. You guys know that meme of no shot? Well, this is called one shot wonder, baby. Those pawns out of here. Shit. Oh. Jumped over him. Oh. 
All right, we're going to die, but we have Death Defiance, and we should be able to kill the king instantly. Okay. Little close, little close, but we're still going. What's this? Two fire range. Rooks have one HP. They can swap positions, refill your ammo, and reload your gun. Rooks have plus four HP. Flip card if there's no pawn on the board. Ah, dude, the rooks are going to have so much health. A fire range could be so good. But refilling my ammo could also be so... I'm going to take the fire range. I might regret that. But I feel like the fire range is too good to not take. Like, that's... That's going to kill him. Yeah, that's going to kill him. Yeah, going to kill these pawns, too. Shit, there was a queen there. Oh, heavens to Betsy. Uh... Fuck. I think we lose here. I think we lose here. I'm in fucking check by three people right now. Yeah. What's up, Plasma? That was definitely game over. Ah, uh, floor nine. Come on. All right. I'm trying again. I miss my two shotgun shells. I miss my two shells, man. One ammo max, reloading without moving. I don't know what reloading without moving lets you squeeze one more. Reloading without... Oh, just reloading in general? King 2 HP. Pawns can't attack diagonally, but they can attack the front two squares instead. I guess we'll take the pawn souls. All right, pawn, I just stole your soul. It felt good. This dude almost got me in the checkmate. The king almost got me in the checkmate. Ah, uh, no, there's no button to reload. You just have to move. Bishops can heal nearby allies. Well, I need the extra ammo, so I'll let them heal nearby allies. Why not? Or maybe there is just a reload button, and I didn't know it. To my knowledge, there wasn't one. Oh, totally worth it. Maybe R is to reload, and I just didn't know. Non-knight pieces can't cross the moat in one move. I'm going to take the blade. I think the blade could come in handy. If we're right in front of someone. The blade could come in handy. Oh my god, they're just... They're feeding, they're feeding. They're bad. Dog water, dog water. All 
right? The first, like, six floors are usually pretty easy. Remove one knight, add two pawns. Pawns go one speed faster. One ammo max. Reload without moving lets you squeeze one more shot on the shotgun when it's full. When it's full. I feel like adding all these pawns is gonna come back to bite me in the ass because the pawns are already pretty strong. Alright, he only heals like one health. He only heals like one, so it's not horrible. One ammo max, 50% chance to knock back enemies. Add two pawns and add a rook. Add two bishops after 15 turns. How add two more pawns, dude? There's so many pawns getting on this board, man. The whole board is filled with pawns and they do so much damage. Oh, I forgot I had a 50% knockback chance. All right. All right. All right. Brave. Oh, he got promoted to the bishop. He got promoted to a queen. Um, oh, I don't like this. Can you guys leave me alone? You can reload without moving. Do you want to hear it? Yeah, let's hear it. It might come in. It might come in handy for me. Two grenades. Queens have less two speed, but they can't die. Move up to three squares in any direction. Give me the wand. Does that count as your turn? So if you just click... Oh, click to load a shell in your shotgun. Oh. I, have I do have that, actually, so... Oh. Oh. I forgot about the pawns! Oh, fuck! In pawns! What's up, Slim? I got killed by a stupid pawn. Alright, one more try. One more try. I gotta make sure these pawns don't have that range. Because that range is actually coming back to bite me every single time. Every time I give those pawns damage range, it, come, it comes back to bite me in the ass. When you kill a piece, a rat bites the nearest target for one damage. Pawns can't attack- oh god. I'm gonna get the bloodless coop. Pawns can't attack me unless I kill one. Now let the pawns live. If I just let the pawns live, I'm safe from them. It's just gonna get stressful. Refill your ammo and reload your gun. Once per turn, you can jump over a nearby damage. Add two pawns, add one rook. I'm gonna take this one. I'm gonna take the reload. Because it doesn't add anything. I lose some damage on some squares and I gain fire arc on the other.
Just don't kill the pawns. And we'll be fine. Just don't kill the... The thing about the pawns if I don't kill them is they will eventually turn into another character if I don't kill the king fast enough. Once per turn, you can jump over a nearby target. Let's take the jump. Being able to just weave through the pawns is actually kind of nice. I actually did kill one there at some point, but... One pawn every five turns gets added. Your bullets... Oh, Jesus Christ. <sighs> Fine, let's spawn a pawn every five turns and make this a mess. I'm definitely going to be regretting that, I feel. Well, they can't kill me. The pawns can. <laughs> I killed the king by stomping on him. <laughs> okay. You can play an extra turn after using a soul card move. Remove one pawn, add one bishop minus max ammo. Add one queen. Queens are moves are limited to three squares. Non-king pieces can't come near your king. I'm gonna take like sometimes the negative effects are just too bad that you cannot take them, I feel. You have one health, you're gonna die. Honestly, this might be the play with the pawns. The pawns being super friendly towards me. That might actually be the reason I win this. Two firepower, add two knights. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus, man. Let's slow down the king and queen. Yeah, the August principle is also going to be good in the long run. The pawns are just like in the way. There's too many of them. Shit, I killed one. I might as well keep killing them. Oh, man. What's up, Zethian? That too many pawns at the end. There was too many of them. Three ammo max. Add one pawn. Pawns can walk two squares on their first move. Uh, sure, whatever. They're not attacking me. I'll take the ammo. Okay. Oh, hey, fellas. Take it easy.
Fuck me, I already killed one. I didn't mean to kill the pawn, he just got in the way. Those pawns are about to spawn into something else and it's not going to be pretty. Oh lord, here comes the bishops. Oh lord, oh god. Bishops are healing, which is that bit, which is better than them moving, to be honest. What's this do? Give me that ammo. healing each other. I can't do anything. I think it's over. I can't... Okay, wait. I can reload. Motherfucker. Oh my god. Walk with the pawns. Let's go, Dragon Link. Oh my God, they keep healing each other, dude. This is ridiculous. There's too many of them. King's finally coming over. The King's finally coming over. Oh my God, we got him. Oh my God. I'm kind of lucky they kept turning in the bishops because the bishops kept healing. Blade becomes useless with this. Fine, we'll add two more pawns. Make this very confusing on me. Hey, give me all the pawns. Yeah, here we go. I don't know how I'm going to do this. Fellas.
But the pawns still promote if they use... There's nothing I can do. There was nothing I could do there. The pawns just kept on... Uh, I, I spawned way too... Okay, we're going to try one more time. I spawned too many pawns. That's what I did. I spawned too many pawns. That's what I did. The pawn strategy could definitely work. But you can't have too many pawns being spawned because then you won't be able to kill them. For the, the eighth game in a row, the pawns were the death of me. Add three pawns. Plus two fire range. Remove one bishop. Add one queen after ten turns. Sure. Means more fire range. I'm not adding pawns. Sick of pawns. Queen got added just in time to watch him die. Replaces rooks, knights, and bishops with a pawn after they die. One ammo max. Gain one ammo each time you kill a pawn. After killing a pawn, promote another pawn if it's the last one. Let's get the rats. I'll take the rats instead. Because I only have one knight on the board, so like... Obviously, we're gonna get more knights later on. Or more everything later on, at least. You know what? I want to kill that king with a rat. I want to kill him with a rat. Yeah, go get him. <laughs> what kind of game is Shotgun King? It's a roguelike game. You can believe it. Roguelike? Roguelite? It's just a shotgun roguelike game where you just kind of go fast. There's not really much meta progression, though, so can you really call it a roguelite? I say, yes. <gasps> God, he turned into a freaking pawn. Looks fun. You can get it for 10 bucks. Add one rook after 20 turns. One ammo max without removing Okay, okay, okay. We'll take the extra bullet in the clip immediately. Oh god, I almost just threw that on away. I can just reload and Okay. The roguelite genre has changed so much. And honestly, in my opinion, roguelite, roguelite, they're all, they're all the fucking same, to be honest. To me, they're all the fucking same. Oh, great. There's three queens on the board. Four score and seven years ago. Bro, there's four fucking queens on the board. Wait, can I... God. This is bullshit. I can't go anywhere because there's queens everywhere. Oh, wait, bottom left is safe. Oh, thank God. Bearbot's here. Bearbot's smart. Bearbot knows. But now I can't go anywhere either. Oh, luckily that actually killed them because we have enough range. Oh. 
I thought I was done for. Oh my god. Sellyman, I think the actual difference doesn't even matter. And if people actually get upset if you're calling one of the other... If you're calling a roguelite a roguelike and a roguelike a roguelite and someone's getting upset because you're not defining the definition perfectly, I think that person's a big baby. They're just a big fucking baby. I am ready for war. I'll go to war over this shit. I care about my video games. And people in YouTube comments get pretty upset with me because I don't define it absolutely perfectly. Not even lying, the YouTube comments get pretty upset at me. Okay, we're on floor eight. Higher power. Queens have less than three speed and they can't die. There are some really nice YouTube comments, though. Alright, so queens can't die, but they're slow as hell. Oh, with the queens being so slow, they're the only thing I need to worry about, really. Remove two pawns, add a rook. Bishop can't attack you at less than two range. Queen can't attack you at less than two range. Add two knights after 15 turns. Pawns can't attack you. Flip this card. Oh, flip this card if a pawn is killed. Literally, this is perfect. The queen is so slow. I can just worry about the rook. The pawns aren't going to do anything. Oh, but now they're in the way. Get rid of that. The queens are so slow, it doesn't even matter. The boy's dead. All pieces minus one speed. Non-knight pieces within your the moat can't attack you. All pieces have more health, but they are slower. Let's make them slower. Give them a little extra health, why don't we? Oh, that queen spawned in a horrible spot. Okay, the queen spawned in an absolutely horrible spot, but... Two more floors. One ammo max, one extra soul slot, two bishops after 15 turns. Rooks have four extra health. Flip if there's no car... <laughs> there's always going to be a pawn. We'll take the extra soul slot, even though it's kind of useless. I just want the ammo. Shout out to the king for showing up right there. <laughs> the king showed up. Okay, okay, we made it. We made it. This is good. This is good. This is good. All right. The king showed up perfectly for me. Oh, this is so easy. 
Oh, oh baby, that was so easy. We had such a busted run, apparently. And so, yeah, yeah, the wrath's dead. Yeah, we got him. <laughs> Cheer up. He would tell them at least Al didn't get blown to pieces as he upheld his shotgun and laughed. Undefeated, he had learned nothing. It wouldn't be too long before a new White King rises up and the whole story starts anew. It literally, it's going to start again. Yeah. <laughs> See, that was easy. That was easy. That was easy. GG. That was an easy run. Having so little pieces made it pretty easily. Best rank one. It yeah. is a travesty. Hey. A blundering hey. mountain of hatred, hatred and, rage. and rage. Adds two pawns on rank two. Two pawns get added on rank two. Do I have an extra shotgun? Ah, oh, I didn't get the, the rainless. Fairbot, thanks for the thousand bits. That was easy peasy lemon squeezy. Nice. I'm glad 